I'm a well-meaning mechanical engineer, but I got into this business by doing the feasibility study and the site location study for di the original Disneyland park. And uh, I've done maybe 2,000 projects since then of the same kind. What I do is the economic side of the master plan, which is how does it work, how does it function. It's a, it's a very measurable science. Uh, you can't predict the heavy day performance that you design to. What we tune in this business is what is the per capita expenditure of the visitor for admission, food service, and above all, merchandise. Fifty years ago, we started doing this thing. Uh, everybody was doing it on the back of an envelope if they did it at all. So I evolved a process, which was the charrette. And I would pick a group of six people. Uh, it would be a mix of talent. So we would lock ourselves up in a room and test the idea, like Walt's old storyboard. When our charrettes would get going, we would have some bloody fights. The clash of ideas is good for the whole process. I hired a lot of people into this work, and I looked for triangle people. One part was uh, fascination with the numbers. So let's not just have a bunch of crazy ideas that we don't worry about the numbers. Then you've got to have an explosive articulation uh, verbally and in writing, then you've got to have people to live with that client, live with the team uh, in a social, socially positive framework and seeing all aspects of the problem, not locked into one narrow band. Walt had a, a certain form of special expertise. He was the world's greatest noticer. And he was always looking for how you could do what you're doing better. And that led to all kinds of inventions in the, in the stuff he worked on, whether it was CalArts or whether it was uh, uh, Fantasia or whether it was uh, a new amusement park or whether it was a ski resort. I think that's a form of genius and talent we need to work on. I could have very easily been locked into Disney. Um, I wouldn't have had the experiences I did. Instead of, uh, you know, the last two decades I did 900 studies, I, uh, I wouldn't have done that if I had not been f free of entanglement and free, free and easy. We had a hell of a lot of fun doing some of these things together.